Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, make sure to subscribe for more content like this. And in today's video, I'm going to be making an audition tutorial for Hype Jeffin's new audition, and so this is for a global girl group. So how this works, I have explained this in previous videos, so how this works is they're making a pop group that's based in LA, so that's the United States. However, it follows the concepts of a K-pop group, so all the audition steps are the same, and all the process, it's all the same. However, they are going to be based in LA and they are going to be more of a pop group rather than a K-pop group. It's just managed by hype which makes it that K-pop factor I guess. So if you are interested in this, keep watching because this is for anyone. There are two kinds of auditions that goes around this. So the first one being the tour part of it. So if you are residing in the United States, so this would be perfect for you. And the other option is the online one. So those who can't make it to the audition because they don't live in the US or you can't travel to there. So the online option is for you guys. So I'm going to be explaining both options to you guys in this video. So let's get on to it. Actually, before that, make sure to watch my audition tutorial playlist for more auditions like this. And now let's get on to it. So let's just first start off on the Hype Labels audition Instagram and we're just going to go on to this post and then see the tags. So that is the official Hype Jeff and Audition Instagram. So we're just going to go on to the latest post and it says Global Girl Group Audition Tour, Show Your Shine. So the on-site auditions are on March 19th, Santa Clara, March 26th, Houston, March 27th, Dallas, April 2nd, New York City, and April 30th, Los Angeles. And they say that they could also add more cities, so please stay tuned. And location and detail information is provided in your confirmation email. So let's say you just signed up for like Dallas, then they'll give you further information about the Dallas audition inside your email, confirming that you actually can make it into the next round. So on-site auditions are pending depending on like COVID-19 protocols per region. And the online auditions are March 7th to May 7th, 2022 PST time zone. And it says, please visit our website for more information. Link in bio. <laughs> the heart is just kind of funny. Okay, so yeah, all the sign up dates are also here. So the eligibility is she, her, them, and you have to be 15 to 19. And this is your global age, not your Korean age. But if you are an EU resident, which is like Europe, then you can be born between 16 and 19. I'm not really sure why they have this. It's kind of just odd that they specifically call Europe residents out. But anyway, the categories are singing, one song, a cappella, rapping, one song, a cappella, and then dancing is a freestyle. And you can sign up right here, which we will visit later on. So the first one, which is Santa Clara, was released. So the registration period is from March 7th to March 16th. So for each um, city, I suppose, they're going to release like a new post like this. However, the registration is pretty much going to be the same. So let's just review them. Let's just review this one and it'll be the same for other cities as well. Oh, okay. We'll just go on to the site. You can also just find it in their bio too accept and then yeah everything that we've talked about oh it says also producing is available for online auditions only which is pretty nice and yeah here is the submission schedule the process is click on apply and then fill out the form and attach the necessary file slash url and then complete the application and has to be one of the following and with the producing it says a, a video with introduction and a url link to the example of original work so music production and songwriting and then you also have to have frontal photos which is odd that you have to show your face for producing but it's whatever and then it says we will send a notice to the selected individuals via the email address provided for the next steps of the audition so let's just click apply now so it gives two options here for the on-site audition and then the online audition so let's just first start off with the on-site audition so everything i've repeated let's sign up it says that it, the registration is closed the day i'm filming this is the 13th so it is definitely not closed but let's just go on to the google form like it is open here so register now for your spot in the santa clara in-person audition so you have to include your email your name first and then last and then your performance category your nationality your date of birth so address phone number social media url and if you don't have it, just say you don't have it. And then how did you hear about the audition? And I've read the terms and conditions and privacy policy and I consent to 
all of these things that are going to be included here and you have to submit the form it's very much so simple oh and i actually didn't know this but the other forms are open as well so for the houston one it's open so you can apply for that so wherever you live and if you can make it in time on march 19th and you can visit santa clara then that would be perfect for you like let's say you live in the u.s and you live somewhere nearby here any of these cities then that would be perfect or i guess even in canada if you do have time to visit that would be good but otherwise let's say you can't make it to any of these cities at these specific times then you would go for the online audition so let's just visit that link again and then go to the online audition apply now and then the online audition submit okay so it leads to another google form i wonder why this one is just a normal purple one but it's very much the same thing except you do have to provide a front photo and so that's pretty much explained in this video if you are interested in that and then the video url and they only allow links so for links it could be a youtube video if you don't want to share your video to the public then you can just have it as unlisted where it's just you or whoever else has that link so that would be hype gets to watch your video and it could also be a google drive link whatever it's totally up to you and those are the only two different things that happen to be in this. And if you're also asking, can I do both the offline and online audition? No, that's not really possible. And if you were to do the online or offline one, then like, why would you want to do the online one as well? Because it's really showing the same thing. And I'm sure you'll do the same exact performance category and all of that. So yeah, it doesn't really make sense. And the online audition is until May 7th. So you have tons of time compared to this one. I guess you would have more time for the online audition. So it's great to audition for the online one if you can't make it until here. So now let's go over some FAQ that they included on their Instagram. So it says we have answers to your questions. Oops, oops, wrong thing. We have answers to your questions. And then next slide. What nationality? No restrictions based on the applicant's nationality, ethnicity, and religion. Will you hold worldwide online auditions again? So the online one is worldwide and it's open until May 7th. These emojis are a little odd, but whatever. Um, can we apply for two categories? Please apply only one audition. So I'm assuming they just mean like, please apply for one category. How soon will confirmation emails be sent? After the registration period closes in your respective city, we will send out a confirmation email with all of the details attached. So they didn't really mention when you'll get a confirmation email for the online audition, but usually it's around two weeks, even can take up to a month, especially because they are busy with the offline ones as well. So we'll see. And do we need to know Korean? English is preferred and it doesn't need to be your first language. So like I said, it, this is a global girl group. So you don't really need to know Korean. It's more about knowing English. Next, for auditions, should be auditioned with English songs. Nope, you can choose any songs you feel confident. So it really doesn't matter what kind of language you do it in, but English is preferred because like I said, it is a global girl group. Is there a time limit for the audition video? No, just please submit your video using URL. Can I audition with my friend? Please audition individually. And then, oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. It's nice that they include all of that, yeah. And just one more reminder because i feel like i didn't really get this straight across but you do have to sign up by these dates and they are open currently they were open since march 7th so just apply for the respective city it can be at any time and they're all up here and i think what they meant was registration closes on this date not closed already if that makes sense so yeah so as I already said, make sure to check out my playlist right here for more audition tutorials. Um, make sure to comment down this emoji if you made it until here. The lettuce edge trim is back, guys. I just thought it would be suitable because Hive Jeffin has like this neon green vibe to it. So it's kind of suitable. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!